today I'm going to show you a quick little uh, video on how I made a back veneer plate out of Evendy to fit over the volute. How I sized it. At first I was measuring the volute and I transferred it to the veneer. But after seeing this, I believe I came up with a faster way of making a template for pretty much an exact template of the volute. Uh, I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. Okay, I've decided just to take some tape and run it across the uh, glue line of the base of it with some blue painter's tape. And then I'm going to go down the edge and get that exact do this edge first Alright, then I'm just going to repeat that to make it a little more stronger. All right. Okay, so now I'm going to pull that off. Alright, move the neck out of the way. And oops, ran out of memory card there. But uh, I'm gonna take this and place this over the draw the drawing that I had marked. Just see how close the drawing was compared to this. Yeah, not too bad, but a little off. So this will be a little bit better guide. Uh, now I'm just going to score it with 
my exacto knife and a straight edge also and uh, then I'll go about cutting it all the way through and fitting it okay once I had it really scored nicely I took it out to the bandsaw and cut really close to the scored line um, as you can see here now I'm going to try to chip away at the edge with a straight chisel back to the line this way I relieve I relieve I'll put the chisel there and I'll cut off this way that way I relieve the pressure and the wood should break off that way and not split back into here uh, we'll see how it goes all right I'm gonna take this put it at the straight edge towards the back put it in a groove and I'm going to do a slicing motion And I'm going to kind of angle it a little bit. Could work this edge a little better. Okay, I'm probably going to finish up the tip with the X-Acto knife, maybe get a little bit closer with a chisel, sharp chisel, try to work it and then probably just use a knife to get into the final tip. Uh, I'm going to do that off camera. Really sharp chisel here. See how that fits. Alright, there it is. Uh, it's a little bit sloppy yet because of this tip. This tip needs to be cleaned up really nice. And it looks like it'll be a good fit. If I raise it up. So I gotta work that tip just a little bit with the razor blade. Okay, as it turns out, I found the best way to really get that point 
is with a Jeweler's jewel, jeweler saw that's probably like a triple aught blade on there. One of the smallest. And I just went in and cleaned it up with the jeweler saw. Probably could have actually cut this whole thing with the jeweler saw once it was scored, but eh. each time you do, you learn something new. Uh, that's pretty much the key finishing it and there you can see it's a nice tight fit down to here perfect well it's perfect as I'm going to get it uh, so now I'll glue this veneer on it and glue the front veneer on uh, finish shaping this up and design the peg head Alright, hope this might help you out a little bit.